Hello friends, I am Dr. Prashant Sharma and you are watching Medicos Hub. This is my sixth lecture on membrane potentials in nerve fiber and I am doing, going to discuss the comparison between the graded potential and the action potential. First of all, we will take the location. Graded potential can be observed at dendrites, cyton, receptors and pacemaker cells of gut and heart while action potential is observed only at exon amplitude in case of graded potential Amplitude is directly proportional to the strength of stimuli. Here the amplitude always remain same irrespective of strength of stimuli. Strength. Graded potential is usually of weak strength while it is stronger having amplitude of 105 millivolts. Summation. Summation can be observed in graded potential but not in action potential. These cannot be summated. Ions involved. It's important to note that both cations and anions can be involved. Cations like sodium, potassium, and anions like chloride. But here only cations have important role to play which will involve sodium and potassium. Nature The graded potential can be of depolarizing nature or hyperpolarizing nature. These are action potentials are always of high depolarizing nature. Conduction. During conduction, very important phenomenon of decremental conduction is observed. That is, the strength of graded potential will decrease with time and distance. Here, no decremental conduction will be there. Their amplitude, their strength, their uh, shape, these always remain same. Mechanism involved during production of or development of graded potential. That is, it involves opening of Mechanical gated ion channels or ligand gated ion channels and even 
some leaky ion channels may be involved. Here always voltage gated ion channels are involved. Properties like threshold value. There is no threshold potential or threshold value for rated potential. But for action potential, it is there. Direction. These move in all directions, but these are always unidirectional. And the last one is refractory period. There is no refractory period in graded potential. But in action potential there is refractory period which is of two types. That is absolute refractory period and relative refractory period. So these are the various points of comparison between graded potential and action potential. Hit the like button, share and subscribe our channel to get the latest updates and notifications.